Hi, I'm Tom with Go Measure 3D. Uh, today we're going to be scanning with the Artec Space Fighter. Also, we have the Artec Battery Pack and the Microsoft Surface Book. Um, we're going to be scanning a machined metal part. If you can see how reflective this part is, uh, most customers, when they're dealing with structure light scanners, they understand that it's difficult to gather information on reflective parts. Uh, the Space Fighter does very well uh, with scanning these parts without treating them. Um, however, if you are dealing with an extremely reflective part, uh, we will use developer spray in order to get those dimensions. Um, but I can show you how the Space Fighter picks up information on parts like this. So, <clears throat> once you are recognized in the software, uh, there is a switch on the handle side of the scanner. You press up once to get your preview of your part. And then once you have established a field of view, you press the up button one more time, and we're picking up data on this part. Like I stated earlier, uh, we're interested in the basic dimensions of this part. Uh, some of the more polished insides of this hole, uh, the scanner will have trouble with without developer spray, but if we're interested in primarily just the perimeters, uh, certain dimensions, or things of that nature, the, the space fighter has no issue grabbing that information. Now that we have scanned the entire part, uh, you press the switch down once to stop scanning. It will process the information that you've gathered. Uh, and we check the information in the real-time fusion. So you see here we have the part in its entirety and its basic dimensions uh, captured here in the model. Uh, however, like I mentioned before, these holes that are more reflective down in here, developer spray would be used, uh, but this kind of shows you how the Space Fighter handles reflective material. So, thanks for watching.